<laughs> they going around calling Nick a dirtbag. Dang. This right here is Nick. He is laying down sleeping in a sleeping bag outside his daughter's room, outside of his bedroom. Why is he doing that? Because of the simple fact, I don't think Leilani wants him in the bed. So I played maybe a couple hours off camera because Leilani only has seven hours left. So we will know if she wants to stay with Nick or move on. So a couple things. Leilani wants to woohoo with Nick. She wants to woohoo with Derek. She also wants to slow dance with Derek, and she still wants to have another baby. So, Nick, on the other hand, um, oh my gosh, there's so much going on. All right, so also, I had Nick go over and um, see his baby. So, he went and seen um, Ezekiel. That's his name. So, he went over and seen Ezekiel and became friends with him. Um, also, the relationship with his mom. Nick tried talking to his mom, but his mom pretty much wasn't like, well, let me go ahead and do this. Um, Nick's mom wasn't really into like the whole him cheating on Leilani thing. So he pretty much told his mom while she's on her deathbed, he was telling her, he was like, look, mom, like I'm done with the whole living a double life thing. Like I want to work hard and, you know, be there for my family. So um, either Ryder or Bonnie is awake, so ignore that sound. Okay, so yeah, Nick had that talk with his mom. Like I said, his mom is on the deathbed, but also um, we will know what um, Leilani will want to do in a couple hours because Nick's mom is also passing. So with the death of Nicole Big Nick on the horizon, executors for the estate will soon have to auction off the house and it's good. Time will Time is running out for family member to step in and take over the home. So basically, I am going to have Nick um get his mom's house so yeah um i'm gonna pretty much have nick take over uh his mom's house i was gonna have him move into a high-rise building where danielle used to stay but i'm actually going to have him take over um you know uh his mom's house so yeah so in a couple hours we will know what um leilani will want to do as far as her marriage wise her and derek have been getting a little closer but Derek is still with Leilani's mom. But Leilani has yet to talk to her mom since the last part. So, yeah, it's a lot. So, also the boys, which is London and Lennox, have aged up in two teams. So, London right here is going to be... London is actually gay right now. So, London is gay. And then um, Lennox is the one who is um, straight. So Lennox is over here sleeping and then um, we have London. So London's new trait is he is eco-friendly and no, that's Lennox's new trait. And then London's new trait is becoming handy. So also London has the um, imaginary friend metamorphium. So basically he can turn his imaginary friend into a human. So basically that is what we will do whenever London wakes up so we will turn his imaginary friend into a human and then we will make that his boyfriend so yes and then Noah has been spending a little time with Octavia so it's not by choice but um he has been spending a little time with Octavia so um yeah he's getting a little closer with her and then also he had the want to kiss her but he wants to talk to his mom so uh, long story short, Leilani actually brought over Derek, but my game had glitched. So that one ended up coming back for Noah. So yeah, that was a very funny encounter. And I was actually going to record it, but my game ended, ended up crashing. So yeah, that's pretty much everything. Um, okay, so Bonnie and Ryder are awake. Great. We love to see it. So, um... Yeah, that's pretty much where we are right now. Um, we still have to wait on Leilani to let us know if she wants to save her marriage or live a single happy life. So I guess we will figure that out in the morning. Okay, so Leilani is awake. I'm going to have her serve up some breakfast. We will make up some French toast. And yes, then Nick should be waking up here soon too. 
We just had to scold Rylan because he ended up peeing in the house, which is a complete no-no. So, I am going to have Miss Lyric go ahead and come on up here and take care of her hygiene and whatnot. So, she has been playing the piano like crazy. I'm surprised she don't have a skill, but I think it's like a hidden skill. So, yeah. So, Leilani pretty much made breakfast for everyone, and everyone's pretty much grabbing a plate and going. So, the house is kind of messy, but it is A-OK. -okay. We got 50 more seconds. Well, minutes some minutes. Alright, so Nick is finally awake. We are going to have Leilani come on down here and snuggle Lily. And then also, we are going to feed her on the floor. We also need to teach her how to walk and talk and all that good stuff. We need to repair that as well. Alrighty, so I am going to have Linux go ahead and sign up for basketball club. And then I am going to have London come on and sign up for let's do woodwork class and then after that i need to have nick go ahead and go on over to oh she's not there so we would have to call her on over here so we need to go here whenever we are done all righty so the moment of truth you guys whose phone ringing who phone is that noah's phone that's Noah's phone. Oh, we don't even know what. Hi, Noah. It's Kenyatta Stallings. Do you want to hang out? Oh, wow. So we don't know if Leilani want to keep her marriage. I really waited all this time just for them not to tell me. So basically, they like figure it out. So I don't know what Leilani wants to do. Oh, okay. After Nick go and talk to his, I think is probably best that we do just let them separate and if they do happen to get back together then that is on them so wait hold on look who's getting hitched linda jackson and Derek cortez be sure to stop by and congratulate the couple before the big day Derek, what the what hold Hold up, because Derek obviously likes playing both sides of the fence because, sir, from my understanding, everything was going A-OK, -okay and now all of a sudden you're getting married? Um, my mom is close to kicking the bucket, and you mean to tell... We're gonna go visit our mom after this. Nick is at his mom's house, so we are gonna go ahead and see if we can call her real quick. So, I just pretty much resetted the lot, so I'm gonna have Nick... Try talking to his mom if he can. There she is. Hi, Nicole. How are you? All right. So she's going to invite us in. All right. So we are going to talk to our mom, be friendly. We're going to ask her about her day. And then also we are going to compliment her home. Just do all the talking and stuff. So Leilani just got to her mom's house. So one second. So I'm going to have Nick finish talking to his mom, and we're just going to keep on talk. Oops. No, we are not going to dare her to do anything. Friendly. We're going to gossip. And, aw. Nick wants a hug from his mom. All right. So Leilani is here talking to her mother. So she's like, hi there. Hello. Can I come in? Alright, so we are going to go in and have this conversation with our mother. We are going to be friendly. Oh, what's this? We are going to go ahead and talk about our family with our mom. mom so she's going to let her know, oh yeah, Lyric and the boys have aged and all that good stuff. So the boys aged. They're big boys now. So you got to come over and see them. We're also going to kind of ease our way into this conversation and be like, um, mom, you know, um, I kind of have a crush on someone. So, you know, uh, you're going to compliment. Okay, so Leilani is pretty much sharing a secret with her mom. Like, hey, mom, I got a crush on someone. Did you know? And she's like, oh, yeah. So Leilani's mom is pretty much talking to her. I need to get back over to Nick because he needs to talk to his mom about getting the house whenever um, 
she passes Hug away. Her. So hug our mom and let's express our fondness and also admire her. Okay, so Leilani pretty much just hugged her mom and she has to let her know like I have a crush, but I don't think Leilani actually knows that, you know, her mom has a crush on the her crush. Like Leilani's mom has a crush on her crush. Does that make sense? So we're going to have to talk to Derek and I think it would be kind of messy to invite him over. But Leilani is pretty much asking her mom like, hey, one day do you like, want to meet him or something? What? Hold on. Oh, no. Leilani Beatnik has been caught seeing another sim and has gotten a reputation for being a cheater. Okay, so basically Leilani's mom is like, oh, I heard, you know, on the street that you were kind of seeing someone. So I guess it is true. So pretty much, yeah, we're going to ask her so pretty much Leilani's gonna tell her like um can you just break up with Derek because like he's mine and I want him so you know break up with him he ain't for you he's for me you know <laughs> I'm just kidding how are you I'm gonna fix that because that don't even make sense if anything our mom would be a little upset at us not him so I am gonna fix that because that ain't even cool so Nah, we gonna fix that. All right. So, fixed it. Um, he is not gonna be mad at us because he's gonna understand. So we are going to let's see. Oh no, he's not home. All right. So we are going to invite him out if we can. So let's ask him out on a date, and we will go to the. I don't even know what time it is. Let's just go to the arcade, and Nick should still be talking to his mom. Yep. Okay. So, Nick is getting good with his mom, which he should, because he needs to do that. So, we are going to... I think it's best that Nick go ahead and talk to his mom and pretty much let her know, like, look, I don't think things between me and Leilani are going well so I'm pretty much going to talk to her today and see if you know maybe we should probably separate for a minute so Nick is pretty much talking to his mom letting her know like look I'm gonna wait a minute <laughs> this can't be good word around town is that Nick beat Nick is a dirtbag too many relationships gone bad and that that kind of thing can happen to a sim <laughs> not that going around calling Nick a dirtbag dang so, um, yeah, like I said, Nick is pretty much going to tell his mom, like, look, I think I'm just going to kind of separate because me and Leilani aren't sleeping in the same bed. We're not talking as much as we used to. It's just not the same anymore. So I think it's best that, you know, I should probably come live here for, you know, a little minute until, you know, she kind of figure out what she wants to do. So Nick is going to finish talking with his mom and then head on home and wait on Leilani. But little does he know. Leilani is going on a date with Derek, so yes. Oh look, and there's Octavia. So he brought Octavia. I guess we should have brought um Noah. So maybe Noah should come here. So yeah, this is Leilani's new outfit. She has on her little V-neck, showing cleavage, her short skirt and her wedges, no ring on her finger, new nails, new hairdo. She is like I am a MILF now, so no longer do I need to look like a wife. We are going to try to kiss him if we can. So after that, Nick is going to go home. Aww. Look at them. Alright, so let's see if we can do a little... Nope. Oh, it is a photo booth. Okay, so I am going to have Leilani come up here and do a risky woohoo with Derek. And then after that, we will go home because we're going to act like Nick had called us, basically stating that he wants to talk. So, alrighty, Leilani girl. Let's see how this goes for... What? Hold up. The kids are at home fighting. Why are you fighting with your brother? Nazir and Lorenzo, Jesus, y'all grew up in the womb together and yet y'all are fighting with each other. Stop it. 
Jesus Christ, these boys. Okay, so Nick just got home as well. So I'm going to let him handle the kids. And then Leilani is about to do this risky, hopefully. It goes through. So hopefully he will still come on up with us. Yes, he is. Good, good deal. Alrighty. Leilani and Derek are about to do a little risky woohoo. Hopefully, get in there, Derek. Okay. So, yeah, here come the risky woohoo. Okay, Leilani. Alright, so we did our little risky woohoo. And, okay. So we are going to ask Derek if we can leave the date because something came up. So we are going to go ahead and go home afterwards. All right, so let's just meet up with Derek later. We're going to go on home and meet with Nick because Nick called us in a panic, basically stating that he wants to talk. So I know we didn't spend much time together, but it's okay. It's all good. Maybe, yes, we will. We will see you later, Derek. All right, so Leilani just got home. I'm going to have her go downstairs, and we will meet Derek down there. Um, ooh, I call him Derek. We will meet Nick down there. Oh, my goodness. So we also got something from John Paul. I was thinking of you. What? No, dude. And we also got something from Lance. Great. All right, so we are going to go down here and have a conversation. Y'all don't follow. Leave me alone, please. All right, so... Here we are. We are about to talk. So Nick is going to have a conversation with Leilani. So their relationship is not too good. But Nick just apologized to Leilani. He's pretty much telling her, like, look, I'm so sorry for everything, you know, that I put you through. Like, I'm so proud of everything that you have done. Like, you have raised the kids. Amazing. They are amazing. You are amazing. So, um, yeah. So, Leilani's pretty much gonna be like, you know what, we do make a good team. So, yeah, let's hope that this conversation actually keeps flowing and it doesn't take a turn. So, we're gonna have a little deep conversation, hopefully, maybe not. Okay, so we are gonna be friendly and we will go ahead and ask her about her day and then we will try to give her a hug then we'll be friends we'll be funny and tell like a funny story like remember how you know back in the day how we used to you know run around stealing candy from the candy store and nick is just talking about the old times with leilani that is so cute and she's like you know what nick i do remember those times all and nick's like you know what i do love you and whatnot so we are going to go ahead and flirt with Leilani just a little bit. Aww. Do a little flirt with her like, girl, you know you're still looking good and whatnot. So we are going to give her a little kiss if we can. Oh, we can. Okay, okay, okay. So let's do a little risky woohoo with Leilani, shall we? So, Nick is pretty much like Leilani. She has forgotten about the past. Um, she really wants to let bygones be bygones. But like I said, Leilani, she's so confused. Like, she wants the family, but we know that Nick has lied in the past. But she has a thing for Derek because Derek just came back into town. And they just kind of hooked up. So, Leilani is about to hook up with her husband which she might be pregnant by Derek or she might be pregnant by Nick. That's coming soon. So let's just hope that it's Nick's baby and we don't ruin our marriage. But Nick has a child, you know, out of wedlock too. So it's okay though. It's okay. So, okay. All right. So Nick and Leilani have just done what they were doing okay nick is getting a call so leilani is pretty much going to come on over here to lily and we need to feed her on the floor and teach her how to walk and talk so we will go ahead and teach her how to walk and then nick is going to take this call so we will go ahead oh that's leilani's phone hold up girl that's your phone 
So we will go ahead and answer it and see who it is. Oh, God. John Paul. No, sir. I do not want to go on a date with you. What's wrong with you? All right. So let's go ahead and teach baby girl how to walk. Nick wants to go to France. He wants to go out of town. Down, and I don't even blame him. So we are going to go ahead and use the bathroom. And then also, I need to have him go over and see his son. So let's see if Danielle is actually at home. So she is not. Okay, so I am going to teleport Nick over here. All right, so... Oh, and that's so cute. See, the the first set of twins, which is L London and Lennox, they are, yes, they are most definitely getting along greatly. So, are you signed up for after school? So, he has woodwork. Okay. So, I think I want, okay, so he is a genius. So, we will sign him up for school council and then also you are signed up for basketball right basketball so i will have him also sign up for oh uh, we can sign up for study club no no we can sign up for let's just sign up for creative writing class have him do that and then after that they can go home i didn't know that they were standing out in the rain so Leilani is teaching Lily how to walk and then Nick is at Danielle's house hoping that he can see his child which I hope he can because that would be nice okay so there she is and fixing this relationship so she decided to break it off girl okay so she is okay so Danielle pretty much don't want to be together and that's perfectly fine I wanted to come here and tell Danielle like I want to work things out in my marriage. So that's what I'm going to do. So that's the whole point of this encounter right now, Danielle. It's, it's really no biggies. I just want to see my son. So can I visit? I just want to see my child. That's it. Yes, it is. Okay. So there he is. So we will go ahead and snuggle our boy. And then we will go ahead and attack him with the claw. And we will also um toss him in the air that's all we want to do we just want to co-parent we are going to be faithful in our marriage no matter what anyone says so we are going to be faithful so let's go ahead and pick up ezekiel give him a couple kisses and hugs and let him know that even though we we aren't together we still love you so is the relationship that he has with his dad and nothing else they are so cute so cute Nick is such a good dad. Like, how can y'all hate Nick? He is such a good dad. He may not be a good person, but he's still a good dad. But he's also trying to fix his marriage, too. So, after that, he's going to take Leilani out on a date. They're going to go out, have some fun, because that's something that they haven't done in a while. So, we are going to go ahead and change his diaper and then we will feed him on the floor if we can and then we'll just go ahead and leave oh danielle broke her tv um okay so pretty much danielle just came up talking to nick telling him like look i know we aren't you know the best of friends but I have drugs and I need drugs. So pretty much Nick is like drugs. Like I haven't sold drugs in so long, Danielle. What the heck? So Danielle is fiending for some meth right now. Um, We honestly thought that she stopped, but she did not stop using drugs. Um, So Danielle, the whole time we thought that we were actually um, selling drugs to her just for her own little, I guess stash or whatever the case may be the whole time danielle has been using so ezekiel that's the reason why ezekiel don't have a crib that's the reason why he don't have literally nothing like this is how they are living so um yeah we didn't know so nick is pretty much he's going to try to stay on danielle's good graces so he is going to repair her tv for her and he gave her the drugs that she want because um 
you know, that's that's just what she asked for. So we giving her what she asked for, and that's that's all we can do. We don't want her to move again. We also don't want her to take our son away from us. So we're going to do everything that we can to stay on Danielle's good graces and also stay on Leilani's good graces because we don't want to lose out at all. So Right, so Nick is going to fix the TV, and then he is going to go. No, he's not. So... Nick is just going to go ahead and go home. I was going to have him fix our TV, but um, it's okay. We're just going to go ahead and go because we don't want to create any type of animosity. They just got back cool. So, yeah, we are going to go ahead. And also, we need to have London, who just got home. Is his imaginary friend up? Okay, so... London has to go up here. Where is his imaginary friend? Okay, so we need to improve our relationship with Rags before we can um, turn him real. So we are going to give him a hug. Okay, so um, actually I will have to do some type of um, little... I guess plan around with this because this thing is basically telling me that I have too many people in my household, which I don't. So it is a okay, but I am going to go ahead and send uh, Leilani and is she still on the phone? Nope, she is rocking. Okay, so I am going to, she wants to kiss Derek. Great. So I am going to go ahead and send them out on a date. So Nick is going to take Leilani out. So let's go ahead and ask her out on a date. So, right. So we are going to ask her out and then we are going to go to the movies. Oh, no, we can't go to the movies. Let's see. What else can we do? Okay. So I think I'm going to have... Nick, go ahead and let Leilani meet his son. But I think I'm going to have them eat first. So let's go ahead and eat here with Date. And then after that, I'm going to have him uh, go over to Danielle's house and let Leilani meet his son. I think it's just that time for Nick to let Leilani know, like, look, I have another kid. You know, I just want this to start off fresh and new so you know no secrets no nothing so that's what he is gonna do so hopefully Leilani will take what he's saying into consideration and not be so upset because Leilani got some dirty secrets too so my entire game is glitching great all right y'all I'm going to have to end this part right here only because my game is glitching I know y'all just seen that um it was just only Nick and Leilani on the portrait thing so i gotta figure out what the heck is going on with my game but i hope you guys enjoyed this part so in the next part we will find out if leilani is pregnant by derek or if she is pregnant by nick then also we will go and meet nick's son with leilani so y'all let me know how y'all feel about nick now and how do you guys feel about leilani and derek moving forward with things and maybe possibly having a baby on the way so let me know what you guys think and I will see you guys in the next part. Bye everyone.